Hey guys, Daphne here. How are y'all? How are y'all? So, hold on, I gotta time lapse this. Oops. <laughs> forgetting something if it ain't one thing it's another all right now what is up everyone welcome back if you are just uh tuning in this is i'm recording week nine of 52 and <sighs> i'm late again but i'm here i am here <laughs> and i really don't want this to be the snowball effect where i continue to kind of like lag my weeks i really want to push it out on time um, if you would say and we're gonna get there okay we're gonna get there but um just to give you guys some context of uh, my day so i'm recording on friday march 8th and it's international women's day happy international women's day to all the women out there subscribed and not yet subscribed um and i wish all of you ladies a hopefully a wonderful day it is currently i think it's around like probably like seven to eight o'clock here in vienna um just got off of work, um, had some, decided to go to a new spot and have coffee with a couple of coworkers. Then I did some grocery shopping. I got the dishwasher going. I'll put some laundry in later. And yeah, yeah, yeah. I did my German lessons. Um, yeah. And now I'm here recording week nine out of 52. And this week, or I guess last week, what, um, last week, I want to talk about how, so this is what happened, okay. So last week I was cleaning my flat, I was vacuuming, and I was just so happy, you know. And first of all, cleaning is not my ministry. I'm gonna just put that out there right now, okay. But I was just so happy vacuuming. I was so happy like wiping down the counter. I was so happy putting the way the dishes in the dishwasher because last year around this time, I didn't have any of this. And I just, just something just kept like playing in my mind to you have to maintain the blessing and I think that's gonna be the title of <laughs> this week's maintain the blessing because we pray for things and then many times we're like oh I, I don't have it I don't you know where is it at and stuff and many times because we're not ready for it right but then when we get it you know, sometimes we get in like a, a boastful spirit. It's like, oh yeah, I got this. You know, forgetting that we didn't have it or forgetting that where it came from, you know. And then, so I'm just like imploring you guys to maintain the blessing, you know, be grateful and be happy and be joyous in the fact that you can have a vacuum or you can vacuum a flat that you prayed for last year or that you can make a bed that you are sleeping in because not everyone has it. You know, and or and I mean, I'm not saying like, and this was this is with every step. Oftentimes, I get excited and talk really fast. Just slow down the video, or I try to catch myself. Um, but oftentimes, we forget where we came from, and and it's not about you know not wanting more because I feel like when you maintain the blessing, it opens door for more. Because in a way, it's like God is saying. Or seeing like okay cool she can handle this you know and sometimes when we lose things I think it's because we a either forgot where we got it from or B we got lazy and we you know didn't maintain it as we should have and so now it's lost or now it's broken and that's like basically goes to same thing with cars why do you think we gotta you know maintain go to the, the shop and Get oil changes or get your tires rotated or fill up the gas tank or put it in the wipers fluid wiper fluid it's because we have to maintain the car in order for it to continue bringing us to where we need it to get to because if you let that thing go high and dry it ain't driving nowhere same thing with everything that we currently have right now you know and i just feel like um, i'm in a season where i last year and i think i saw, talked about this how last year i wasn't you know where i was and i am where i am now and it just looks different and i think that will most likely probably be like the theme of the year as far as give it give your lifetime like seriously give your lifetime to develop you know and 
as much as like we say time is short, which is it, which it is, you know, and no, none of us know the time or the hour or the second, you know, um, but while you're here, while you can do it. And I remember uh, <laughs> this week as well, I was just like, oh, I don't feel like dressing up or oh, I don't feel like getting camera ready um, and camera ready for all of us is different. It looks really different for all of us. And because um, right now I have I look like this on top. I wear pajamas at the bottom, okay? My socks are like donuts. <laughs> like, and I mean, but that's just like, I'm just so comfortable, you know, to be at home. But obviously also I want to present myself a certain way, you know, and I think all of us should be proud of how we look and, you know, how we dress or whatever the case is, but also how I present ourselves on camera. Um, and, but yeah, but embrace the blessing. Main, not embrace maintain the blessing is what is what it is and um that that's literally the word or uh, or the phrase of this week of this past week which was week nine of 52 and i just really hope um this kind of reminds someone to not let go of what you already have before you can truly be appreciative you know of it I hope that makes sense. Um, and yeah, so last week, I wish I remember what happened last week, or it was actually a really busy week last week at work. And um, the girl was up early and home late, and I was tired, and um, I didn't want to do my lessons, but I still did it. I didn't want to, and like life happens so fast sometimes that literally I just feel like, like my flat is a mess and then I'm just like which means my thoughts are a mess and everything else is a mess and so um I like so that's why I was cleaning because I was just like I can't just I can't function I, I can't do anything and uh many times as well like our thoughts get like that and it obviously shows in our surroundings and so but again picking up you know my clothes putting it in the wash you know putting things into place where it belongs and just i just felt so good that i could do that that i could have my own and that um this blessing that i have i prayed for i cried for <laughs> um and that i have it now and it's just like now it's just tears of joy now it's just a joyous heart and um if i don't tell anyone anything is your time will come and when it comes, I really hope that you receive it with open arms, with no doubt, you know, and that you can really take it in. Because sometimes when we're blessed with things, we allow fear or doubt to kind of not let us enjoy that. And I mean, myself included, like I've received things or I've gotten things and I, just, and I felt like I didn't deserve it. And it's just like, no, you deserve it. You're worth that and more. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. This is a very short word. Um, again, my goal this year is consistency and just showing up weekly, um, which I'm kind of slacked on, but don't tell nobody. Um, <laughs> but I wish you guys have a great day. Uh, again, whenever this comes out, I have no idea. I'm not responsible for that. I am, but y'all gonna get it. And don't forget to share. If this resonated with you or if you feel like someone can use this word, to share it and again these weekly videos are literally just uh my thoughts or maybe something like uh was really presented to me this week or you know and it's just kind of like what's been going on what's happening if something obviously significant which is every i feel like every day is significant no matter how we take it every day is significant because we were able to wake up this morning um but yeah so happy international women's day I hope everyone has a great day. Maybe I'll actually publish this today because it just makes sense because, anyways, yeah. I'll see y'all on the YouTube, okay? Y'all have a good night. Cheers, bye-bye. <laughs>